Hello guys, we're back here. Uh, gonna finish up the shelter, the wiki up shelter. I know I said we were gonna finish it. You know, I was gonna finish it off camera, but I decided why not finish the series. Come out here, bring you guys another video. First order of business, I actually have to find the shelter. <laughs> that might be a tad tricky. We're gonna get a fire going, make some tea and stuff. It's gonna be a good video, so. It's actually kind of already covered itself with some snow, which is good. This is funny, we've actually got some snowshoe hair tracks uh, around, our, around the, the shelter here. Pretty funny, so I guess animals have been using this uh, since we since we were last here. Pretty cool, actually. So first order of business, we're gonna have to clear out the area a little bit. We're gonna get our whole uh, fire area here dug out, as well as the inside of the shelter cleared out because there's still snow in there. But but actually, as you can see on the sides of the shelter, there's already snow piled up, which is what I was gonna come here and do today. Um, not all of it's piled up, so we still got some work to do. But yeah, let's clear out an area and get a fire going. I actually already have to take my jacket off. It's just, just kind of working up a sweat, I guess. It was funny. The snowshoers have actually gone in there and uh, you pooped in there and stuff. So it's kind of cool that there's been, uh, you know, hairs using my shelter. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, this is gonna be really good. Um, I definitely need to kind of fix it up a little bit. Um, I'm thinking I might just be able to. The snow's kind of at a point where. There's like a layer on top that's kind of icy and it's pretty rigid so you can kind of use those as blocks and I think that's what I might actually just do. Just put those blocks on top of the uh, of these uh, saplings and whatnot that we kind of covered it with. That way I won't have to go cut down a bunch of you know this evergreen stuff. Yeah this is going to be really good. Um, I'm going to try to clean out the inside a little bit more and then we'll get a fire going because I don't want to be like cleaning it out while we have a fire here so this is going to be really good. I'm excited. All right, we got the whole thing cleared out from back in there in the shelter. We got this kind of circle area around here. This is where we're gonna be putting the fire. And then on the inside here, you can see, I took most of the snow out of there because I don't really want to be sleeping on snow. So now what we gotta do, I'm gonna figure out this pit here. We're gonna have to uh, dig down a little bit in the earth and flick some of that dirt up so that we're not burning right in the snow. We're gonna have to kind of like, uh, well, make a fire pit. We're gonna have to dig a kind of a fire pit. So uh, I'm gonna go do that and then we'll get some materials. We'll get a fire going and then we're gonna start uh, fixing up the shelter. As you can see, the ground's pretty frozen here. Once you get down a little bit, it's actually not too bad though. You can see that's just clay right there, so. We're just gonna have to kinda dig a fire pit best we can for right now. We'll see how it works. We're gonna kinda make kind of a reflector or kind of heat wall here. Cause I want the heat to come back at me when I'm sleeping. So that's what I'm gonna do. So you can see I was breaking up with the ax. And yeah, my ax will probably suffer because of that. But uh, like that, like I have to do, I have to do this with the ax. Cause there's not really, I mean you might be able to get somewhere with a shovel, but not very far for this top crust layer is, and anyway, you gotta get it with the axe pretty much. All 
all right, so I've just collected some smaller stuff uh, just off the bottom of some trees there, just the dead stuff. And then we got some little uh, bigger stuff. We got the birch bark. Just gonna get a fire going. Um, it'll kind of warm the area up, get it ready for whenever I sleep here. Okay, so I just got a pot here. Just put some snow in there and melt, so. There. Put that in there. Gotta make sure, you know, watch it so that it doesn't tip over or something. But it's gonna take a little bit probably to get this from uh, snow to water, but. I don't know, it shouldn't be too, too bad. I'm gonna put some sticks in here just to keep it going, and then I'm gonna start uh, putting snow on the shelter. I'll get to work. Okay, so we got some decent work done on the shelter. We're just kinda, we still got some stuff to do, some work in there to do, but we're uh, definitely making progress. I think our water's boiled now, so yeah, it's definitely boiling. Okay, so we'll just take that off the fire there. Grab my backpack here. Just got some uh, matcha green tea here. Um, there's a few floaties in there, but, but it'll be good good for you anyway. There we go. Put the lid back on there. Smoke kind of in my face, but that's okay. It's nice out here. Forest is so peaceful. There's a bird over there somewhere. Perhaps a squirrel. It was funny. Over there I saw some uh, coyote tracks come up right next to the fort, so we'll uh, we'll try to, you know, keep a fire going because I don't really want to have a run in with one of those. Not that I don't think they'd really do anything because they're, uh, you know, they're just a coyote. They're not like a wolf, but, I mean, they do have actually, the coyotes here, the, they have actually part, uh, they are part wolf, actually, red wolf, so. Um, but I, I'm not really too, too concerned about that. There's a crow up there. <laughs> Man, it's nice. God's creation is so beautiful. Mm. That's good. It's super hot though. <laughs> super hot. I would really like to do more of these, uh, you know, out in the woods here solo overnight. So we'll see how this, this one goes and I think we'll be doing plenty more. Um, hopefully plenty more before uh, it, uh, it's summer. But during the summer we'll definitely be doing quite a bit of them, I'm hoping so. Or even, you know, camping out with a friend and stuff. That's, that's a lot of fun too. If you guys made it this far in the video, um, I just want to say thank you so much. And if you guys did enjoy, Please hit the subscribe button, and that'll you know let me know to do more of these. And uh, yeah, we still got some work to do here. Uh, it is working, just breaking up the snow and putting it on like the big ice sheet type things, and then we'll you know scoop more snow over top of it. But it's actually quite spacious in there, so that's good. We'll uh, be pretty comfortable when I'm sleeping. Alrighty, we're gonna have to get back to work. Where the sun goes and yeah we're gonna finish up the shelter and in the next video we'll be sleeping in it let's get back to work
All right, guys. So we got uh, we got the shelter all covered up with some snow there, and now I'm just, I just cleaned up the inside of it because obviously there's you know bound to be some that just uh, you know snow that comes through I guess. But right now the temperatures aren't super 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 cold. But as you can see, we have quite a bit of snow. So. But anyway, guys, thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video. It's all overnight. We'll be sleeping in this thing. If you guys enjoyed what you saw and you want to see more, make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. Thanks for watching. Please make sure to check out my sponsors, Duke Traps, Dan Beaver Trapping Supplies, and Long Creek Trapping Supplies. Links are going to be in the description down below. But anyway, we'll see you in the next one. Talk to you then.